Okay. Hi, my name is Mei Lu. I'm a Toastmaster from the Richmond, Virginia area. And I love Mr. Bennett's presentation. Very dynamic, very high energy. Emphasizes the points that we need to make to build our potential in leadership. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> hey, the Wayne speech today was just awesome. He really hit up some great points. Uh, the one thing that resonated with me was close the gap from knowledge to actually doing. Uh, this is something that is constantly on my mind, and I think I can. I believe I come to the right place at the right time. So, thank you. Okay. Okay, my name is Teresa Irvin and I'm from the James River Toastmasters Club and my major takeaway from this meeting today is the phases of leadership growth, knowing what I don't know, recognizing what I don't know, knowing what to do and how to get there and taking that growth and knowing that it starts with me and it's simple because I can do it and believing in myself and having that courage to go forth and make that change and make the change in my community. Thank you. Hi, my name is Ryan Jenkins. I'm with the Synchronous Set 5A class of 5 I love Ryan's presentation. He was very motivating. He taught me to want to be an intentional leader, and I especially liked his point about the stop doing list because I think many of us, many times, have too many things on our list to do, and now I'm going to really focus on my strengths. Thank you. I was very empowered, very excited by today's speaker, Mr. Bennett. He's a dynamic speaker and he convinced me that I need to invest in myself and become what I want to be. I highly encourage anyone to listen to him, buy his reading materials. He just inspired me so much. Thank you. I want to thank uh, Brother Dwayne for uh, his energy and his synergy and for just taking the time out to uh, allow us to hear him talk about how he has uh, become the person that he is. I also want to thank him for that little bit of information about um, your leadership ability. It's one of the main things that determine your success. It woke up something in me and made me excited and I just want to thank you and uh, for your time and thank you. Brenda. <laughs> Hi, my name is Brenda Wright. I'm with Some Simply Said Toastmasters. I'm from Richmond, Virginia. And I have certainly been inspired today by Mr. Dwayne Bennett's presentation today as far as leadership. And one of the things he inspired me was he said leadership ability determines a person level of success. He has certainly proved himself today. I'm so excited. I can't wait to get back home and apply these principles and become a leader in order to lead someone else. Thank you. Hi, my name is Nuri. I am <coughs> I'm from uh, Williamsburg Voices and uh, English is my second language, so I would love to come to all the Toastmasters conferences, and I really enjoyed doing today very much. I learned a lot. I took quite a few notes. I make sure I go over and over again. I can't wait to, to read his book. Thank you. <laughs> My name is Janelle Savat. I am part of District 66, the Toastmaster that I am a member of is Peninsula Powerhouse. And I came to the conference today. And I know it's a respect. Um, I chose this class with Mr. Bennett, and I just felt so inspired. I learned so many things. We tend to, what stood out with me most was we tend to want to focus on what we're not good at so that we can exercise that and become better. But instead, I have learned that I should just focus on the things that I naturally do well. So I will be doing that. Um, some other things I learned, I will be taking that and using that into my daily life. Um,
name is Dwayne Bulls, I'm with the Blue Ridge Toastmasters Club, you guys 1914 in Charlottesville. And I really enjoyed today's presentation. The three things that I took from it was when it said raise your lid, was to improve yourself. And that leadership is influence was the second thing. And that we're not just leading, but we're influencing others to change their behaviors, to become better. And also leadership develops daily, not any day. So change is not going to happen overnight. It's a gradual process. I'm grateful that I was here. My name is Seh Al-Assad. Um, I am uh, retired, but I have been a Toastmaster for many years. I really enjoyed today's presentation by Mr. Dwayne Bennett. It's a very important subject of leadership. We got lots of tips in today, and I'm going to apply lots of the concepts I have learned today. Hi, my name is John Steinbach. Uh, this is the first time I've heard or uh, seen Dwayne uh, do a presentation. I was especially impressed with the energy he brings to the platform. And his content was, was spot on as far as leadership goes. I like his concept that the our leadership level puts a lid on our level of success. And his suggestion that we work on our strengths rather than try to build our weaknesses up. So thanks very much, Dwayne. I'm Tisha Bakes. This was my first time hearing Dwayne. I thought it was a really powerful experience, primarily because it starts with leading yourself. So the idea of developing and growing other people is not really important until you can actually lead yourself. And knowing that the level that you lead yourself at is going to determine the ability to lead people to where they have to go. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jay Carter, and I'm just grateful that I had the opportunity for this Saturday workshop. And I think I learned a great deal about being an intentional leader. It means a lot. Sometimes we are not as serious as we could be, and therefore our successes show that. I'm also grateful for the opportunity to hear about where the ship starts at home. I think that was a very fine point about starting at home. And knowing that leadership is ourselves, we be, we will do, and we will be successful. Thank you. Appreciate you, Mr. Bennett, that I had the opportunity to sit in on your session. Thank you. Hi, my name is Dawn. I just got to hear Dwayne Bennett for the first time. He has the energy and inspiration that everybody needs in their life. He's a very good speaker, and I enjoyed it, and I noticed that the notes were easy to take, and he involves the entire crowd, and so just very inspirational, and I liked the whole getting leadership in your daily life. Apply what you're learning. Don't just learn it. Apply it. He was very good. I highly recommend him. Hello, my name is Leticia Adams, here representing Toastmasters as well as DuPont. Today, I had the awesome opportunity to witness Dwayne Bennett and his presentation around being an intentional leader. And I can tell you with my own personal experience and what I saw that his presentation is absolutely amazing.